So my question to you is, when you saw that that was happening, right, so Delta starts to hit, we've got a couple trillion dollars in stimulus that has gone in. So right. we're seeing an increase in demand based on that, and you see the supply chain start to dry up. So why didn't that set off inflation alarm bells and say, we've got to pull back, we've got to pull back on the stimulus, and we maybe have to start to increase interest rates here? Yep. Uh, that message could have come if from the were, Fed. So you had a lot of warning right. with the things that you're talking about. And we were told, oh, it's just going to be over by the end of the year. It's going to be over in a couple of months. But none of that turned out to be true based on all the things that we all could see. No, actually, that's not right. And I will tell you again that in June, July, people mm -hmm. did not see the impact of Delta. They did not see the impact of Omicron. They did not see the impact uh, or the, that there would be this type of uh, unthinkable war. And as that happened, everybody in the world has had to deal with this. And the United States, if you were paying attention, President Biden was on it fast with a supply chain task force. 